Hello, Rifton. This is Miss Klein. Excuse my voice. I'm still a little bit under the weather. And we're in the Rifton band room and we're working on a mallet part today, a percussion, and we're working on Gingerbread Men on Parade by Len Orsino. So I'm going to focus the bells. Again, they're upside down, so they're in the same direction. You actually look at them. So even though the mallets look upside down, everything else is exactly the same, left to right, as you would be playing. So let's get started. So this is the lowest part of the bell set, <clears throat> and the largest part, and this is the middle part of your bell set, and up here is the part we're not really playing the high part. And you're going to be using the notes B flat, C, D, E flat, F, and G. I'm going to start F and G. So again, you're going to have your mallets looking like that. Because I'm playing upside down, mine are the opposite, but I'm using the same hand. So you're going to go left, right, left. Give it a try. F, G, F. One, two, here we go. One, two, three, four. Then you're going to move your hands down to D and F. Nine and a buck. Here we go. D, F, F. D, F, F. G, F. E flat, D, C, F, F. G, F, F. E flat, G, C. F, E flat, D, F, C. I'm oh, sorry, B flat. Okay? So we're going to try that section again at 9. Usually I want you to alternate. It's a lot of motion. You can just keep one on each uh, note. D to F. 9 in a box. 1, 2, ready, and go. D, F, F. D. F, F, move over one, G, F, E flat, G, C, F, F, G, F, F, find E flat and G, E flat, G, C, F, E flat, G, F, going B flat. How do we do? 17 in a box, you're going to find G and E flat, and then you're going to move down to F and D, and then E flat and C. Let's do that again. G and E flat, F and D, E flat and C. One, two, here we go. G and E flat, move down, F and D, move down, E flat, C, and back up. G, E flat, F, G and E flat again. G and F, reverse, E flat, C. And three notes in a row, D, C, and B flat. How do we do in that section? So again, we have every other bar. There's a bar in between we're skipping. G and E flat, and F and D, E flat and C, and then you go back up D, E flat, F. The second time, G and E flat, then at D and F, then back down E flat, C, G, C. B flat. Give that a try. 17, 1, 2, ready, go. G, F, E flat, D, G and E flat, G and F, E flat and C, D, C, B flat. Good job. 29 is an optional part, so I'm just going to play it for you. Um, we're not going to spend a lot of time on it, and if you want a bonus, you can. We're going to start on D and then B flat. So you have D, B flat, F, B flat, C, G, F, G, B flat, D, D, B flat, F, B flat, and C, G, F, C, E flat, D, and C, and B flat. I'm sorry I messed that up, playing that upside down. So 
but we're going to move on. 37. It's almost like we did at uh, 17. We have G and E flat again. 1, 2, 37, and go. F, D, F, E flat, D. Move down to D, B flat, quieter, quieter. All right, good job, everybody. I'm now going to turn the whole thing around, and I'm going to play it looking at it. And so it's going to look a little bit opposite to you, but let's see if we can play it together. So give me a moment while I spin this around. So that I'm actually looking in the same direction you would be when you're playing it. So it's going to look upside down to you now. So now this is the large N, and this is the middle. Find your first note, F and G. I'm going to do the whole song without stopping. One, two, here we go. Rest, two, three, four. Let me rest for five measures, and we're starting at nine. Find D and F. One, two, here we go. Seventeen. G, reverse. Hopefully you did well. I'm going to jump to 29. There's the optional section. Find D and B flat. One, two, here I go. Thirty-seven. Jump back in. G. F. Double F. Move to D. Last three notes. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. It's a lot of notes. A lot to remember. Keep working on hitting the bar in between the two uh, screws to get the best sense, and I'll see you on the stage.